we are back finally with another recipe video. We've been super busy just getting the trailer started up and serving for the last few weeks. It's been an amazing experience so far. I've learned so much in the first few weeks and I'm really happy that I've been able to get started before the baby comes and just have a better sense of what it really takes to run a food business. Today's recipe is inspired by a side we've been having in the trailer lately. It is perfect for fall. We've been serving a caramel with apple slices as a side and we've gotten so much great feedback from people on how much they love it. I love this recipe because it's only four ingredients. Let's do it. The first thing you'll need for this recipe is pitted medjool dates. We're using one and a half packed cups of dates or 350 grams, which we'll put into our food processor. I'm weighing out about 150 grams of almond butter, which is equal to two thirds of a cup, and then we'll add this in with the dates as well. You'll also need a teaspoon of vanilla extract, as well as a heaping quarter teaspoon of sea salt, which really gives us a classic salted caramel flavor. Then we're going to process and pulse this just to start bringing all the ingredients together, stopping to scrape down the sides as you need. Once things start coming together, I add in about five tablespoons of water. You may need more if your dates are on the drier side, but this amount I found to be just right with my dates. You let this process stopping to scrape down the sides as needed. You can see it's really starting to come together. I like to let this go for a while as you can get a really nice smooth texture the longer you work with it. This here is pretty darn close, but I let the prude processor do its magic for about another minute or so just to get this ultra creamy texture as you can see here. You can store this in the fridge for probably even over a week. It, it lasts a while and this also freezes really well. I thought I'd meet you guys in our backyard to give this a try. So let's see how it is. Here comes Evie to join me. <laughs> it's hard to believe this is only made with dates, almond butter, vanilla, and salt, and a little water. It's a really nice sticky caramel. I love eating it this way with apples. I also use this in a caramel cream pie recipe as like the middle filling layer and it is amazing. So I hope you guys give this recipe a try. Let me know if you have any questions. Please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I'll be hopefully more consistently posting some recipe videos and I'd like to kind of coordinate it with what we're serving in the trailer just so people can see what we're making and enjoy making the food themselves because that's part of the whole point of this trailer is to inspire people to eat vegan and whole food plant-based and see that it's delicious, but also to try it out yourselves. I want to be completely transparent. I don't want to, you know, keep any of my recipes a secret. I think that it's important to share the love and encourage other people to cook these things at home too. So I hope that you give this recipe a try. Thank you so much for watching. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram to see where we're serving. And as always, eat more plants.